Loma, you really don't need to make me anything right now. I can get something to eat at home. Oh, it helps keeping busy. Besides, it's the least I can do after all the crying I've done on your shoulder. That's what it's there for. <sighs> Noah, what is going to happen to my brothers? If Ethan can't get a retrial on appeal, Miguel is going to spend the rest of his life in prison, and Luis is going to die at the hands of the state. <sighs> well, maybe that's better than a slow death in jail. I've heard how the other inmates treat you if you used to be a cop. I hope you like enchiladas. Yeah, it's great. Good. It's an old family recipe. Paloma, I really want you to try to, to not think about your brothers. I, I mean, at least for tonight, right? I've never met two guys more capable of taking care of themselves than Luis and Miguel. Noah, you don't know the prison system like I do. It's not a healthy place to be. Especially if you're innocent. And it's even worse if you used to be a cop. Okay, they're not going to be in there for long, right? My dad and Ethan, they're still investigating the case. They're going to find the criminals, and then they'll clear Luis and Miguel's names. Eat up. You do like spicy food, don't you? Love it. Good. My dear Maria in Mexico used to say that that's how you could pick out the man of your dreams. By whether he loved the taste of your cooking. Well, then I'm really going to like it. <laughs> Let me get you something to drink. Okay. Good? Words cannot explain. I'm glad you like it. I don't mean to brag, but this is my specialty. You know what? I wasn't going to. But I think I'll have some too. <laughs> Dios mío! This has way too much hot sauce! How can you be eating this? I, uh... Noah, you were trying to spare my feelings. You must have thought I was completely loca. Well, uh, maybe not ready for your own cooking show, but I just... Oh, I'm so sorry. I wasn't paying attention. I must have put in a tablespoon instead of a, a teaspoon of spice. Oh, my God. You have to be the sweetest man in the whole world to eat something this terrible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. If I was going to get that kind of reception, I would have gone back for seconds. Mm. On days of our lives, Sal's ex-husband found out that we're still here. One man stands in the way of their happiness. Surprise, surprise. Now, they're getting off this island. It's over. My family is mine. Even if it kills them. Days of our lives. I'm a total loser. I can't even make a dish I've done a thousand times in my life. Shh, it wasn't that bad at all. Okay, I was rough going there for a while. I was beginning to wish I had a will. Why do you even hang out with me? Even if I hadn't almost killed you with my food, I'm a total downer because of my brothers. No, look, anyone would be upset right now. I'd be more worried if you weren't upset. Isn't that what a relationship is about, right? Being together through the good times and the bad. I guess.